for me and for every good festival programmer that I know, there is nothing better than finding a film completely unknown from your pot, giant pile of DVDs or now screener links and just falling in love with something new. Like that was literally the coffee that fueled me through many late nights of, of, of watching movies. Um, and I had that experience many times. Like I remember one year I took home, uh, here's a tip, always submit early. Cause I'm like sitting there, it's the beginning of the season and I'm like, I wanna start watching, but nothing's come in yet. So I just took home literally everything that it came in, watched five films, four of them I didn't really respond to. And one, I was just like, this thing is incredible. I've never heard of this filmmaker, it's amazing. The filmmaker was Garrett Bradley who just was nominated for an Oscar for time. Uh, and it was her first film, Below Dreams. Um, and uh, so like submit early, but otherwise, like the thing that I would say is that like, I would be lying if I said that like who the filmmaker was and their previous work had no sort of bearing on how I watch things. I think most festivals track, you know, most festivals like either I did it or like an intern or an assistant would go through all of the submissions and sort of like make a spreadsheet about what had come in and who the people involved with the films were and you get emails. But, but what I always tell people is like being like on a, on a festival's radar doesn't mean that you have to have like one Sundance or like made a giant, you know, blockbuster movie. It could literally mean that your first feature played at Cinequest or, you know, uh, and, and that, that's sort of like what I would call like a proper noun. You know, I participated in a screenwriting program. I won a Nichols. I, you know, uh, had a short at um, the Maryland Film Festival. These are the things that like I would look for because I would be like, all right, well that tells me that this isn't just like somebody straight out of film school. This is somebody who's like, a, a you know, starting to build a career for themselves as a filmmaker. 